Now, digital fabrication consists of three processes. There's CAD, computer-aided design, CAM, computer-aided manufacturing, and software to control whatever machine you'll be using. Now, we can break this CAD process into three parts. You can have 2D, 2.5D, and 3D. And it's what your end result will be that will determine the type of program you want to use. 2D geometry will either be a vector or a raster. Vectors, they're true lines. And for building stuff, it's what we want. You can see it if you scroll in or magnify your screen. If your line does not mush out uh, into a bunch of small squares, then you got a vector. Rasters, which are things like pictures, we'll use them for decoration. We may even turn them into vectors. Now, those are actually pixels. If you scroll in on them on your screen, you will see that they turn into small little squares of color. Failure to know what you're dealing with can cost a bunch of money and more importantly, time. Uh -huh.